if you watch my video before this I have I believe 115 pounds and that's just the outside yam harvest I did not show you the harvest that we have from the greenhouse which is no less than 35 to 40 pounds 40 pounds of yam so here and actually I still have some that has not been processed we have eaten so much and even shared some and the rest we put we're putting in a freezer and this purple yams are very special that's why you can preserve it by freezing them and there's a lot of uh, recipe for purple yam you could make ice cream uh, cakes and so many and uh, so many other desserts yeah all kinds of desserts you could make out of this and uh, the white yam you could defrost cut it up into pieces make home fries for breakfast or just steam it serve it with olive oil and butter or butter and whatever else you want on the side but this is how I make my harvest last and I pretty much do a lot of freezing and canning or um, what do you call that pickling now there's two ways you could uh, preserve your harvest for short term preservation you can simply use your freezer Ziploc bag but uh, this kind of uh, what do you call this this kind of packaging here which is from food saver I believe it will give you a much longer uh, freezer life without worrying about the freezer burn because what this food saver does is that it will suck out the air out of it and pack it tightly I will show you the process that I went through we leave this in the oven overnight to let it cool completely and the next day we peel them it's a lot easier to peel them when they tightened up the next day and pack them like this for freezing We are going to use some olive oil, uh, Cajun seasoning, of course you could use whatever seasoning you like, like uh, seasoned salt, paprika, etc. Butter, white yam, purple yam or ube. This is uh, optional. You could add bell peppers or you don't have to if you don't want to. And onion.
Okay, so that's olive oil. And that's enough. And butter. Maybe a little a touch of salt gonna season it. I tasted it. A little piece and it's gonna blend. Just a touch. So today we made a simple, super simple uh, home fries, which just about anybody can do. So I show you that my husband can actually manage it with a little help. And this is his favorite fried eggs or eggs over easy home fries using yam, white and purple, and three pieces of bacon there. <laughs> and if he's up to it there's a bowl of fruit in there so this is another way you can enjoy your purple yam or white yam harvest for breakfast lunch or dinner